there are two very, very um, well-known compounds that can cause damage to the liver. First of all, alcohol. In moderation, alcohol can be very beneficial, particularly in one or maybe even two drinks a night if it's something like red wine. The polyphenolic compounds, resveratrol, in the red wine can be very hepato or liver protective. Uh, but too much alcohol begins to damage the liver, causing scarring, leading to cirrhosis and other problems. Next is uh, fructose. Fructose is a sweetener used in many of the uh, fast food products and sodas that we consume on a regular basis in this country. Fructose has been um, shown to be the cause of metabolic syndrome, diabetes, and of a non-alcoholic fatty liver syndrome called NASH, non-alcoholic uh, steatotic hepatitis. And this fatty liver syndrome is caused specifically because of a high intake of refined carbohydrates, fructose specifically. And this is on the rise in America, and it is becoming a major cause of liver failure and liver problems in people today. Uh, it can lead to serious cirrhosis and liver failure and even the need for liver transplant in the long run. Now let's look at the environmental uh, aspects. There are numerous environmental compounds. I'm not going to talk about all of them or address them. I'm just going to say that the environmental exposure to toxic chemicals and compounds is a daily event for all of us. Some of us are more at risk. and. Um, uh, what we want to do is we want to protect the liver and the liver's metabolic detoxification of these chemicals because sometimes the way the liver metabolizes these chemicals can be dangerous. For instance, you have a phase 1 and a phase 2 detoxification mechanism within the liver. Many of the environmental chemicals are first detoxified in the phase 1 um, section of this uh, metabolic process. And in so doing, sometimes those chemicals are made into more radical or oxidative chemicals, and they need to be immediately taken up into the phase two um, um, mechanisms of our liver so that they are then stabilized so that they can be eliminated through our biliary uh, tree or through the bile and the gallbladder into our intestinal tract. Now, we need to have some very important antioxidants on board if we're going to protect the liver in this metabolic process. And some of these compounds are uh, epigallocatechin and catechin compounds from green tea, um, uh, silymerin from the milk thistle plant. Silymerin is an antioxidant flavonoid compound from the milk thistle that can protect and stabilize the hepatocytes, the liver cells, from damage from these radical chemicals that are intermediates in this breakdown process. Also, N-acetylcysteine, or NAC, very, very important compound. It is so beneficial as an antioxidant in protecting the liver that it's uh, also used in Tylenol poisoning. When people take too high doses of Tylenol, Tylenol damages the liver and NAC can help protect the liver from that damage. Uh, Silymerin is used to treat patients who have had mushroom poisoning because some of these poisonous mushrooms kill us by damaging the liver and the hepatocytes and liver cells. And silymerin is the medication of choice in treating those patients and preventing death by protecting the hepatocytes. Lastly is alpha-lipoic acid, another very, very important natural compound in our body that is especially beneficial in preventing NASH. The, uh, the fatty liver syndrome that I was addressing earlier. So what you really want to do is look for a nutricutical complex or a product that is a complex of these compounds that will affect phase one and phase two, stabilize the hepatocytes, the liver cells, and uh, allow their membranes not to be damaged by these radical intermediates from the environmental met or from um, uh, metabolism of these environmental chemicals. So the product that I like best for protecting the liver 
and helping it detoxify these dangerous chemicals is Hepatovis. Uh, it's one of the products we offer on the dispensary online. If you look at the contents of Hepatovis and read the description of the product, you'll see many of the things that I just talked to you about are in that product. Now, here's a little keynote and a little trick for you. I always take two to four of these capsules if I'm going out in the evening and I'm going to be with friends and I know that he's going to certainly offer me at least two or three of his homemade beers or we're going to have two or three glasses of wine or more uh, through dinner. I'll take two to four of these capsules before we go out and I'll take another two to four when I get home with a little extra water and you know what? I feel great in the morning, no hangover. So there's a little keynote for you. Thanks.